what is going on guys welcome back to another tutorial video today i'll be telling you guys how to get the ultimate the best better pushback mod ever um currently in microsoft flight sim 2020 it's gonna be a short tutorial just a simple uh, download file click and drag and drop into your own file and that is that it's gonna be an external application so it's not uh you don't put it into the community folder but i'll show you from there other than that let's get straight into the video all right guys you guys should know the drill at the top of the description it will be the link to this modification so it will bring you to the flightsim.to website as where all the mods are currently right now which is actually a very good website i recommend you guys check out to get liveries and everything else but other than that um this is the mod right here so it's gonna be a simple menu like this so you can activate jetways and everything so you don't have to communicate through a to c anymore so it's very helpful Especially if you're flying on VATSIM, like me, for example, where if you have to change frequency, then you have to kind of change back to the ground frequency or whatever you're contacted on VATSIM. But yeah, so you just want to go down over here to download and click download. So you have to wait five seconds. I'm not sure if this is one way you have to have an account, but if it does say so, just simply just make an account. It's not, it doesn't take too long or anything. So once you get that, it'll be here. So you just want to open a file. You can unzip it. You can read the readme as well if you want to. So this just simply says how it's an external app, but you don't have to put it into your community folder. So simply what you want to do is, I just made my own folder in whatever drive, and you can just copy, literally just highlight all of these. You can either press Control C, or just right click and copy all files to clipboard, or simply just hold them on all and just drag and drop into whatever file, and I'll show you that right now. So as you see right here, all you have to do is just make your folder in whatever hard drive, and just simply drag and drop, and it'll be right here. So this is what it would look like, um, this is the only, uh, this is the main application. So you just want to double click on that and this is what it would look like. So I'll go into the sim and I'll show you what it does and how easy it is to do a pushback and all. All right, guys, we're back at the sim now. So this is what the menu would look like. It's pretty simple, nothing special about it. You can call fuel truck or you can get the jetway. See, all you have to do is simply press it and the jet will come along. Same for the pushback. So you just want to press activate. Uh, you should say disconnect. It'll just say disconnect for like a couple seconds, like 30 seconds or so or less. And then it'll connect all of a sudden. So yeah, you can see how easy it is. It will just come up here and then basically controlling the aircraft is very simple. So if you want to do it, usually how I would remember is if I'm like facing this way, like facing the front of the aircraft. So left will be this way and right will be that way. I just think it will be a lot easier. So once this tug starts to connect to our aircraft, I'll just show you how simple it is to move around. Now he's connected, the tug is on the way. So you just want to release the parking brake and this is how easy it is. So if you want to go left, Simply drag to the left, and then if you're like, oh no, wrong direction, just quickly switch, and it'll switch the other direction. You can go straight, and so on. If you want to stop the pushback, just press activate again, and then the pushback tug will go away. So literally, that is how simple it is. You can just start your engines right now. So if I want to go full to the left now, I can just hold it, and just leave it, let it do its thing. And then when I think, okay, that's enough, I just press activate, and the pushback will stop. So yeah, that's how simple it is, guys, to install this mod and how to use it. Anyway, guys, I'd like to see you guys on the next one. Take care, safe flying, and yeah, see you in the next stream or something. And now, folks, it's time to say goodnight. We sincerely appreciate your patronage and hope we've succeeded in bringing you an enjoyable evening of entertainment. Please drive home carefully and come back again soon. Good night.